Angelo! Time to take some chances and expand man's horizons. I wonder. Angelo does! Yes. Yes, you have. Death will be along just as soon as I make sure you're all here. You haven't brought along any unexpected guests. Can't be too careful these days. Glad we have an understanding. Well, looks like everyone's here who's supposed to be here. All clear. Come ahead. Hey now, cowboys. Face to face at last. And just as handsome as I thought you'd be. Figured we'd meet here to remind you what be these folks are alive today because you chose to help them even though it meant going against the patriot to my mind that's the ranger way helping the helpless ahead of the powerful just something to keep in mind as you hear me out <laughs> good eye doc it's definitely put a hitch in my talk but this and my fake leg are souvenirs from when my chopper got shot out of the sky over Long Beach, California. But, uh, since you've obviously got the skills to use them, here, I got a few extra med kits on me. Try not to use them all at once. Well, ain't you polite. Hope that... Now, the way you dealt with Vic and Val tells me that we're eye to eye on most things. So hopefully nothing I say here will surprise you. As my friends and I see it, two things gotta happen to save the people of Colorado from tyranny and slaughter. First, Liberty and the gang she's gathered out east have to be eliminated. And second, shit! <laughs> Scar collectors. Well, well, speak of the devil and her minions shall appear. Looks like Liberty overheard our rendezvous call. Guess we'll have to deal with this before we continue. Takayuki. Stupid. <laughs> Bye bye. 
Need to make a few more, obviously. Now, the way you dealt with Vic and Val tells me that we're eye to eye on most things. As my friends and I see it, two things gotta happen to save the people of Colorado from tyranny. Second, and you're gonna love this, the patriarchs gotta go too. Holds it might be, but the way we see it, possible chaos is better than actual tyranny. And we're hoping that, as rangers, we'll be able to help mitigate that chaos and give Colorado a chance to live under some honest-to-God rule of law for it. And for that, we need your help. Oh, thanks for hearing me out. I've got to hand it to her. Daddy's little girl has done the impossible. She's united the boldest and baddest warlords of the Eastern Plains. And she's getting ready to lead him into Colorado. When she does, well... <sighs> well, that'll be the end of this place. Every man, woman, and child from here to the Rockies will be killed, enslaved, or taken as a sacrifice. And their houses and towns burned to the ground. None of us want that, right? Glad to hear it. So originally we hoped you'd help Cordite take control of the gangs again, so he could lead them all off to Kansas and his blood-soaked destiny. But since you dumb sons of bitches couldn't keep the man alive, that's not on the table. Cordite, Cordite. Right, the, um, <clears throat> cannibal guy. Instead, we want you to get into Liberty's camp, get her warlords to kill each other, or leave. Then finish her off in the confusion. I ain't saying it's gonna be easy. Hell, it might kill you. But it's the best chance we- Now, I'm guessing y'all have some questions. Pete and Brother Thomas came back with me from LA, and Tax from Arizona. These others are locals who have various gripes against the Patriarch. We trained him up as best we could. Nicer bunch of folks, you'll- Pretty simple, really. The Patriarch has spies watching Liberty's compound. If you show up, those spies will think you're there on Daddy's behalf. And they'll be happy if we show up. Our plan is revealed, yeah? And that would give the Marshals a chance to button up Colorado Springs before we make our attack. They'd be waiting for us. Now that's gonna be a fight. Basically, while you're taking care of Liberty, my team will be in Colorado Springs, softening the ground. Once our primary concern, other than ending the bloody reign of the Buchanans, is minimizing civilian casualties. That means you've got to ride herd on your crew and watch who you ally yourself with. We want to be the good guys here, so we've got to do this clean. Rape and pillage is a surefire way to turn people against their liberators. 
Keep the peace, keep things fair. I don't see the Rangers running things. I see our job as keeping the plane. There's always a lot of weasels that come out of the woodwork after a big man falls, trying to grab a piece of the pie. So we're just gonna hang around, and every time a weasel pops their head up, we'll, at the same time, whenever somebody comes along who tries to take care of the people, all the people, we'll help them out. But we ain't gonna be anybody's muscle. We'll answer to the people, nobody else. No idea. Nobody's tried it before, as far as I know. But it's worth a shot, right? Can't be worse than the way things are now. Well, for one thing, we ain't paying the man. We ain't actively funding murder the way old. And second, despite Cordite's destiny, my guess is he goes back to Kansas and him and his rivals all wipe each other out, leaving the whole territory a more pe All right, then. What's it gonna be? What? Oof, there's a load off my mind. Thank you. You're gonna make all the difference. Now, here's the location of Liberty's camp. Be careful when you get close. The gangs don't... You mustn't do this, Rangers. Please. I am... If you follow this path to its conclusion... Hmm. Good luck sorting it out, cowboys. We'll talk again when Liberty's taken care of. I need to probably change them. Her and... and Quan. Right now. Yeah, okay. Let's go back to the base. And get... Two members. Team November, this is Ranger HQ. The Brainiacs in R&D just showed me some of the wild stuff they're done working on. You should come take a look when you're free. Over and out.